What is that thing? This is Appa, my flying bison. Right. And this is Katara, my flying sister. Wow. That was truly amazing. Yep, yep. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> hey, Katara. Hey, Sokka. Hi, Aang. Thanks for coming. Yeah, that was real convincing. Great, so they get their mail on time. They do get their mail on time. Nice guy. Just jump down and you'd land in a big, soft, cottony heap. Maybe you should give it a try. I think you can do it, Aang. Yeah. We're all gonna get eaten by a spirit monster. I was talking to Appa. Well, I was talking to Momo. They were waiting for me. Hey, don't feel bad. You're only 100 years late. Well, let's see. You pretty much mastered airbending, and that only took you 112 years. Yeah, nothing's braver than a guy in a treehouse. And the only way in and out of the canyon is with his help. And he's taken my tribe across next. Great, Aang. Maybe instead of saving the world, you can go into the jewelry-making business. Look, I'm going to predict the future now. It's going to keep drizzling. See? Oh, well then thanks for all the first aid over the years. Like when I fell into the grease fire bramble. And that time I had two fish hooks in my thumb. Oh, and the time that mink snake bit me. Thanks for healing that up. That was great. Really helpful. I have an idea. Why don't we all get on your back and you can fly us to the North Pole? I'd love to. Climb on, everyone. Sokka is ready for takeoff. These are real uniforms captured from actual Fire Navy soldiers. When? Like a hundred years ago? Is something wrong, Sokka? Oh, no. Han's out there on the top secret mission while I'm here sharpening my boomerang. Everything's fine.